Hello friends, welcome back to Hindu Judaic with yet another video. We will talk about artificial intelligence and military, an Indian perspective. Hindu Judaic request you to please subscribe our channel, and if you have already subscribed the channel, please click on the bell icon to get the notification of each video upload from Hindu Judaic. Artificial intelligence, also dubbed as the Industrial Revolution 4.0 has been making giant strides in scientific and technological innovation across various fields. It is capable of bringing significant transformations in the way civilian activities and military operations are conducted. Till now, the idea of attaining military superiority was conceivable only to a few countries like the US, China and Russia, who maintain large armed forces. Artificial intelligence being a dual-use technology may have interesting implications on the distribution of military power in the future. The possibility of AI-assured advancements has opened the scope of an arms race where the conventional military capabilities will matter much less as time progresses. As a result, middle powers leading in civilian AI tech also has the field wide open to compete for hard power. In this light, India is hard pressed to enter the AI race in defense sooner rather than later. In January 2019, Army Chief General Bipin Rawat was noted to have said that India will be too late if the armed forces do not embrace AI soon enough. The Ministry of Defense MOD, constituted a multi-stakeholder task force for strategic implementation of artificial intelligence and defense in February 2018 that submitted its report in June. The MOD implemented the recommendations by providing an institutional framework for policy implementation, issuing guidelines to the defense organizations and laying out a vision for capacity building. In February 2019, the Ministry established a High-Level Defense AI Council or DAIC under the chairmanship of Minister of Defense assigned with the task of providing strategic direction towards the adoption of AI in defense. The DAIC will guide the partnership between the government and industry and also review the recommendations concerning the acquisition of technology and startups. It also envisions the formation of a Defense AI Project Agency as the central executive body. The ministry ordered to focus on the capacity building within defense machinery. The tasks range from the knowledge production in the form of data collection, patents, etc to acclimatizing the personnel on duty through internships, training programs and sabbaticals. Each service headquarters will be provided with a window of rupees 100 crore for AI specific application developments from the ministerial budgetary allocation. The task force recognized AI as a force multiplier and emphasized that all the defense organizations lay down their strategies of AI appropriation. The Center of Artificial Intelligence and Robotics CAIR, in the Defense Research and Development Organization has also developed autonomous technology based products. It has focused on the net centric communication systems for tactical command control for surveillance and reconnaissance purposes. CAIR has developed interviewing probes like snake robots, hexabots, and sentries. It has a comprehensive library for AI-based algorithms and data mining toolboxes that can potentially be used for image video recognition, NLP, swarming. However, in a data-based approach to artificial intelligence, efficient learner algorithms can only serve a limited purpose without the hardware that can collect and process a large amount of data. The key challenges for the adoption of artificial intelligence in general are elucidated in the Niti Aayog's 2018 document titled National Strategy for Artificial Intelligence AI for All. In addition to this, there are many challenges that AI brings up in the military sector. Firstly, policymakers must have a sound understanding of the objectives that AI seek to achieve in the strategic context of India to disseminate artificial intelligence in defense. What kind of AI do we want? Do we require fully autonomous drones to engage with the adversary 
aircraft in a dogfight or deploy autonomous patrolling vehicles at the borders for getting the job done. How much autonomy should be given to the machines on the battlefield? A clear vision of the AI program is necessary for a middle income country like India that cannot afford to invest heavily in this sector. It is a matter of guns versus bread and butter. There is a trade-off between spending in national security and public welfare. Secondly, the lack of critical infrastructure is one of the biggest impediments in the prospects of AI in India for both civilian and military uses. As AI runs complex algorithms on loads of data, it is essential to have robust hardware and enabling data banks within the country. If a critical AI-based military technology harnesses the data on a remote server located beyond the borders, it can potentially hinder the goal of Indian foreign policy from preserving its strategic autonomy in a way that it might be compromised. Thirdly, the role of the private sector will be pivotal in making the AI accessible and efficient. As AI demands high skill and capital, innovations need an ecosystem supporting the free flow of both money and skill. However, as per the existing FDI policy in defense, only 49% of foreign investment is permitted within the automatic route above which it needs government approval. India has traditionally been conservative in handing over the reins of the defense industry in the hands of private sector. Leading powers like the US, China and EU and France have their vision documents for research and development programs in artificial intelligence. To begin with, India should envisage a clear strategic vision regarding the AI on similar lines. An academia industry policy synergy is of utmost importance to realize the strategic, societal and cultural implications of AI in defense. The government should create a supportive ecosystem in which the AI industry in India can thrive. There is a dire need to invest in critical infrastructure so that the data servers lies within the territory. Apart from ensuring strategic independence, it will also address data privacy concerns. New Delhi, whose major security priorities lie in the subcontinent, cannot ignore the progress made by China in the field of artificial intelligence. The State Council AI Plan released in June 2017 outlines China's ambitious AI policy which aim to create an AI industry of worth 150 billion RMB. That is tenfold its 2017 figures. In the end, the AI in defense vision should be centered on achieving military modernization over balance of power considerations. Thus, artificial intelligence is of utmost importance looking into future of Indian defense. Friends, hope you like this video. Please subscribe us for more such videos. Thank you.